So you're going to go to Makanga, it's one of these, these areas that were affected uh, two years ago. This is the scene across almost how does that look? It's an area that has been cut off partially during the floods. In anticipation of what may happen, the idea is to map actually the, the area properly and to be able to, to intervene fast to plan the resources that are needed uh, according to the situation. So first, um, we need to prepare really to identify all the airfields and uh, after we need also to prepare the drone and all the equipment that we will uh, need. For small areas, we can use the drone, it's easier, we can fly in a lower altitude than just with aerial images uh, below the clouds and we can have really precise pictures. At the end of this mission, we will have many pictures of the area. We will try just to get just one big picture of the Makanga Island. From this picture, we will try after with our GIS software just to, uh, to digitalize all the access, all the roads, and try to find all the access for our missions. Having the capacity to straight away map where the population is and to visualize that on a map allows actually to, on our side, design the intervention and helps tremendously to communicate uh, at a distance with the decision makers, with the actors on the ground, and to actually understand uh, the scope of the situation and fasten the decisional process.